This morning on The Blend, we have with us Jim Olson, who is with U.S. Staffing Agency. Jim, we're talking about, you know, the most important skill that people can have as they return to the new normal. And I'm curious if you can tell me a little bit more about that. Yeah, for sure. You know, Bob, thanks for having us on The Morning Brew yeah. today. And, and yes, Michigan is preparing to reopen over the next few weeks. And as we reopen, there are a number of changes that, we're, that we need to be ready for that we're just going to have to like uh, enter into as we go into this new normal. Well, talk a little bit about some of those new changes that you're talking about as, as we look at that. Yeah, so this new normal will be different in a number of ways compared to our pre-COVID time, if you will. It's going to be different both for work and social life. You know, for example, people will likely keep that social distancing gap around themselves. The uh, traditional handshake, for example, as a greeting, it's probably on the way out. Uh, people will most likely be wearing masks even after the mandate to wear them ends. You know, and people will not just be encouraged to stay home when they're sick. Uh, there's probably going to be some extreme social pressure to self-quarantine. So a number of changes that we're just going to have to get used to. We're going to have to be okay with them. So, Jim, as we prepare for these new changes, is there one skill that you think maybe we could learn? Yeah, I think that there is. Um, it's a soft skill. And uh, a soft skill is a skill that helps us interact with other people. Soft skills are not like learning math or learning uh, to drive a car. Those are hard skills. But a soft skill assists us, uh, assist us in how we socialize and work together. You know, during this time of transitioning, Bob, the most important soft skill that we think that people are going to need to learn is empathy. Mm. Empathy in short, you know, it's the ability to put yourself into somebody else's shoes so you can, you can feel what they're feeling. Okay, so what advice do you have for people? Uh, to, is, is empathy something that we can learn? I mean, what advice do you have for people? Yeah, we can learn it, but it's not easy. It's a change of heart and mind to work together to try to understand other people. Uh, at U.S. Staffing, we've developed a number of short podcasts on some soft skills. Go to our website. Well, we're making those available for public consumption. And check out the podcast on learning and practicing empathy. Learning that soft skill of empathy, it's going to help you in your work and your social and your family relationships as we transition into this new normal that's in front of us. Jim, some good advice you've given us this morning. Thank you so much for joining us, and we'll, of course, put your information on the screen. Thank you, Bob.